trying now for the fourth time to make this video. I don't know what's wrong with my phone. Um, this is the fuel filler neck assembly for a 2010 GMC Sierra. This is what I've been doing all morning. I had to take this out because as you can see, it's all rusted and it was leaking fuel. You're gonna need several tools for this. This is a 10 millimeter bolt. You're gonna need to take that off with a 10 millimeter socket and a 3 8 ratchet. These pieces here, there's three seven millimeter bolts that go directly into threaded holes. There's no nut on the other end. I recommend taking those off last with a quarter inch ratchet and a seven millimeter socket on a six inch ex extension. That'll give you plenty of room. This here is a sensor. The original one comes, the original one that was on my truck had an, a male piece that stuck out. The replacement part had this. That's no problem even though there's a, um, a piece underneath that you need to slide that male piece into. You simply pop this off the new piece. I had to cut my old hose to get the piece out, but it's fine. It slid into the new one and no check engine lights came on or anything like that. So you just, I, I found what was easiest for me was I disconnected these first, disconnected everything, removed the entire assembly, after I, after I got that disconnected, pulled everything down. You have to wiggle it a little bit to get it out of the rubber hose that goes into the fuel tank. Not a big deal. Uh, it came out eventually. The new one slid right in. There's a, a clamp that goes on it. So you're gonna, a hose clamp that goes on it. So you'll need a flathead screwdriver for that. But uh, this is really about it. It came out and I put it back in. There are no check engine lights. There are no issues and I got to go to the lumber yard to get some lumber for uh, picnic tables. So I hope wherever you are that this is helpful and that you learned something from it, that it did something for you. If you have to do this repair, don't worry about it. It's not that hard. Uh, so I hope you're comfortable. I hope you're happy. And I hope that God is with you. Thank you.